Today we'll demonstrate how you can use your smartphone to store barcodes and remotely collected data directly into a database on your PC in real time. For this you need the Scan it to Office app for your smartphone and the Smart Database Connector software for Microsoft Windows. First install the Scan it to Office app for Android or iOS. The Smart Database Connector installer is available for download on TechIT's website. The Database Connector saves data recorded with the app immediately into databases. The Smart Database Connector is managed in the browser. The address is usually HTTP localhost 33333. This tutorial uses a Microsoft Access database pre-installed by the setup. In the upcoming videos, we'll show you how to define your own databases as targets. For now, let's take a closer look at the display QR code. This QR code is required to connect the Scan to Office app with the database. Just scan the QR code with the app and that's it. Your smartphone and database are now connected. Every barcode or QR code read with the smartphone is immediately stored in the database. But how does this work? The Smart Database Connector runs as a system service in the background on your PC. Thus, the function is available even without a logged in user. Data collected with the mobile app is forwarded to the Smart Database Connector via cloud services and stored immediately in the database. Data acquisition is completely location independent. It works anytime and anywhere. But Scan it to Office has more to offer. You can freely configure the database and the data to be collected all by yourself. For example, data from input forms with multiple input fields can be processed. Instead of a database, it's also easy to use Scan it to Office with Microsoft Excel, Google Sheets, or other target applications. Any number of apps can be connected to a database simultaneously, making Scan it to Office the ideal data collection tool for work groups and teams. Inventories with automatic quantity counting are of course also possible. Watch the next videos to learn more. Subscribe to our channel, leave a like or a comment, and as always, thanks for watching.